First of all, shout out on the Buckeye legislation. Big fan of that. <laughs> Can we talk about this ranked choice voting and your opposition to it and why you're helping Teresa Gavarone with I'm not a helping quote unquote. Gavarone. I'm helping what I don't think is something. I mean, important. but you know she's running for Secretary of State, right? And she and three other people are Republicans that I but, but you're helping her with, I mean, elect, well, no, electioneering no, hobgoblin. No, I don't believe in ranked choice voting. I never have. I haven't from. Do you I see what been. did you see what Rep, uh, former Senator Portman said about it? Yeah, I, do I care what Senator Portman says about anything in life? No. Okay, but I mean, he was right about it. It's, it's kind of one of those, you know, the worst people you know have a correct opinion. You well, know, good that's point. Not entirely true either. I mean, again, uh, I don't. I don't get my keys for so long. I wear my keys. I'm this way. I, mean, I don't believe in ranked choice voting. I never have. And it's not, I mean, the Democratic Party isn't sure where it's on ranked choice voting. I mean, it just seems like a favor to the Franklin County Democrats, you know what I mean? Uh, you're one of the most politically connected Democrats up here. Yeah, so what are you mean by a favor to the Franklin Democrats? Oh, I mean, I don't think that it would, it would make it harder for them to, for their, uh, you know, the sample ballot candidates to win, having to go through multiple elections and all that. Well, I don't think, I don't think ranked choice voting is fair. I mean, it's, no, we just had an election about one person, one vote. And this is the opposite of that. I mean, if you don't... No, I mean, mean it's still one person. You still well, have one person, one vote. already shown that undereducated and minorities and poor people don't vote all the way down the ballot. So it hurts their vote. And uh, again, I don't think it works. Um, so you're saying I, poor people and minorities aren't smart enough to figure it no, out? No, but if they don't tend to, on studies have shown that they don't tend not to vote all the way down if there's five or six people on the ballot. I mean, th that's what the facts say. I'm just... I mean, the facts say it'd be better for democracy. You get better candidates, and I guess it's true. Your facts say it'd be better for democracy, not my facts. Okay. Well, can we talk about uh, Dan McCarthy and why you guys didn't like? What was up with that vote? You guys just like let him get appointed. I, I didn't realize until after the fact that he was even on that because you I didn't mean, realize until after the fact. I mean, he's one of the most corrupt. I mean, he's one no, of the most. No, no, I know what I'm saying, but I didn't know. I mean, this is you know, like 45. I, there were 45 names on that thing, and if the caucus doesn't point it out to us, I mean, you know. I'm on seven committees. I can't. I had two committees. I'm, I mean, so I don't know. I mean, do I have the time to look through everything in life? No. And I missed that. And I, I feel bad I missed it. But again, I mean, no one caught it. Um, I mean, everybody caught it. Oh, hell, I gotta go this way. Ah. <laughs> oh. Damn. I never used that. Yeah, it's, uh, it's complicated. Um, I mean, again, I don't. I missed it, and I usually am better than that. But on this occasion, I missed it, and I'm, I should have, I should have caught it, but I didn't. Was there anything we can do to get him out of there? I mean, he's. I don't think so. No, I, I don't think. I don't think there's a way to once once it's been confirmed that that there's a way to get out of. It. I, I don't know. I don't think there is. If there is, I'm certainly willing to look at it. But I don't think there is. Okay. All right. All right. Appreciate, it, brother. All right.